You know, the thing about the absolute state of the internet nowadays is that everyone is basically, uh, I guess, a kind of survivalist, a doomsday prepper, because I think there's this general acknowledgement, especially on big sites like YouTube, that in a couple years, everyone on these sites is just going to be, like, demonetized or banned or zucked, and, like, there's going to be nothing left but, like, shills and, like, mainstream media news outlets and, like, makeup tutorials. So I think everyone, everyone's in this search for like, oh, let's find alternative platforms. I love alternative platforms. Um, which of course, you know, they're sort of memes because no one really watches them. I mean, there are some with some viewership, but nowhere near uh, the, the usability of YouTube. So for the longest time, I've just wanted, just because all of these alternative platforms are bad, I just want to have videos on my own website, right? Because that is, you know, that's the real way the, it, the internet's supposed to be. It, it shouldn't be that P, you have to go to like YouTube to interact with someone on the internet. You should just, they should have their own websites instead of having their own Facebook pages and you know, a Facebook profile, YouTube profile, Instagram profile. Why don't you just have your own website? You know, that that's the thing we have to get back to. And I think we're sort of in the state where people are starting to be like, man, this is getting so bad and maybe, I don't know, maybe, maybe we need a blast from the past, okay? Now, I'm not saying any of that, but I will say, well, I am saying that, whatever, but uh, I'm not saying that's definitely going to happen, but um, I have made my own moves in the past couple uh, weeks and months. Now, as you guys know, uh, a couple weeks ago, I did a video on PeerTube. PeerTube is not really an alternative platform. It's actually software that you can run on your own server. This is what my PeerTube instance looks like. Oh, actually, look, I've been sort of, you know, making my website look, uh, cleaning it up. I got all this little anime boomer working on my website back in the 90s. There used to be like, there used to be little gifts like this on every single website, little under construction gifts. It's a meme. I don't know. You Zoomers won't know. But anyway, uh, PeerTube is software that you can run on your own server. And it serves up your own videos and, uh, you know, sort of it gives you your own YouTube-like site. And, you know, I, I put this up a couple weeks ago, said I, I might try and get it working. Um, and a lot of you guys are already following it. I'm, I mean, I'm already getting a couple hundred views on all these videos, uh, which is basically the same viewership I would get on, you know, these meme alternative platforms like BitChute and Library. Um, but, uh, so it's very nice. And just so you know, I know a couple weeks ago when I did a video, a video on this, I said, oh, well, uh, I, I don't know if I can handle the bandwidth or whatever, or I don't know if I have enough storage space. Basically some, uh, subscribers, uh, hooked me up with a, a better way of doing it. Unmetered bandwidth. Very nice. Shout outs to, uh, Harambe who helped me with that. Um, but, um, yeah, so basically now I have my own separate VPS for videos, and of course all of these you can you can go on, you can click on, um, and uh, you know you can like, like, comment, and subscribe, just like YouTube. Um, so it's it's a very nice site. It, it runs pretty quickly. Well, it's running slowly on my computer because I'm in the middle of nowhere. But uh, the if you get the traffic elsewhere is really fast. Uh, I've checked it. Uh, no complaints. And so uh, you can comment and all this kind of stuff. There are some things it doesn't have yet. Like you, you know, there are comments, but I don't think you can like the comments or if you can, uh, I don't know, I'm a boomer and can't figure it out. But, um, so it's just really nice to finally have my videos where I don't have to rely on some other, you know, kind of, uh, you know, media platform that's going to change its user, user interface all the time or, um, you know, it, it you know, isn't going to spy on people who are watching my videos. It's nice to be able to just have this. It's torrent based to minimize uh, bandwidth usage. And in the future, here's sort of my vision. Okay, here's my crazy vision. Probably won't happen, but this is my vision. Okay, um, I want to start adding stuff to my website to make it more like I want to have text tutorials as well. Okay. Um, where I might have a page on my website where I'm like, here's how you do this. I can embed videos from my PeerTube instance very easily or give you links to them. Um, it's just, it would just be nice if I could make my website a little bit more all inclusive. So it'd be somewhere, you know, back in the day, like this is, this is probably for a separate video, but back in the day, individual websites used to be really enjoyable to browse. Okay. That is like, no longer the case anymore because nowadays if you go to someone's website, if you go to like a soy dev website, it's going to be like a blank play page and like, here's a link to my GitHub and my Instagram. And that's about it. And I just can't, I can't stand that. And I wish, so here's my, my problem. I have too many links to other sites on my videos. Oh, I have, oh, here's my GitHub and my GitLab and my Git server and stuff like, well, I guess Git server is my own website, but, um, uh, you know, I want to be able to have like pages that are actually enjoyable to br enjoyable to browse, which does not even exist 
on the web on the internet anymore. Zoomers literally have no idea what I'm talking about. Like there aren't like web pages you go to just because they're fun. Like I, I don't know, it's just Facebook and everything. So I'm gonna do my part. You should do your part by having your own website. You can check out my playlist of how to do that. Um, and you know, if you're gonna follow me, you know, I'm still gonna be on YouTube. I'm still gonna be putting stuff up. Um, but I, I sort of, you know, PeerTube is probably a better place to do it. I'll also say in the future, oh, and this is the RSS feed for my uh, PeerTube instance on my website. In the future, I'm thinking about doing this. Now, if you guys watch this channel, you know my upload schedule. It's usually, oh, I'll take a month or a month or two or maybe three off. But when I come back, I put up videos pretty much every day. Um, now I usually take Sundays off. I take the Lord's Day off. Um, but uh, I think in the future I'll probably put up videos every weekday, like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then on Saturday I might put up a PeerTube exclusive of something that might be too based in red pilled for YouTube, um, or um, you know has um, I, I don't know violates might have music or something that you know YouTube is going to mark as you know you can't listen to or something. Oh, actually I just uploaded an old, old video from like the first year of my channel that got restricted on YouTube. Uh, so a bunch of a bunch of the stuff on PeerTube is actually no longer on YouTube because it's been banned or something like that. And I think I I don't think I have my live streams up here. I I sort of want to put them up eventually, but um, yeah. All right, so that's it. That's my vision. That's what I'm thinking about. Um, I'll, I'll be doing more, I, I don't know, whatever. See you guys next time. Have fun. Oh, and you should all have an anime boomer like this on your website, okay, when you make it. Oh, by the way, go to giftcities.org. That's where you get them. That's where you giftcities.org. I hope that's the right website. Let's see. Yes. Yeah, you can search for old boomer gifts. okay? Best site on the internet.